Okay, in this video, we're going to look at how the density of the nucleus depends on the nucleon number and the radius of the nucleus. So show that the density of the nucleus can be written as rho equals 3u over 4 pi r naught cubed. U is the atomic mass unit. Okay, you can find this in your data sheet. It's like the average mass of a proton and a neutron. Okay, r naught is a constant, uh, 1.05 femtometers. Okay, so we're going to try and find the density. So the density we know that is mass over volume. Well, how do we get the mass? Mass is going to be the nuclear number, which is the number of protons and neutrons, A, times the average mass of the nucleons, which is the atomic mass unit. So we're going to put that in there. Okay, so AU. The volume, well, the volume of sphere is 4 over pi r cubed, and, and the nucleus is roughly a spherical. So I'm going to put that in there as well, 4 over 3 pi r cubed instead of volume. I'm going to rearrange this a bit. 3 over 4, the 3 from the bottom comes to the top, over a u pi r cubed. I know from the last lesson, the last slide, that r, the radius of the uh, atom, of the nucleus, sorry, is equal to r naught a to the power of a third. Okay, so I'm going to put that in here as well. So I'm going to put that instead of r. So if I do that, 3AU over 4 pi. And instead of R, I'm going to use R naught 8 to the third cubed. And then I'm going to simplify that. I'm going to expand that bracket. 3AU over 4 pi. Well, the R naught is, is going to get cubed there, so R naught cubed. And A to the power of the third, to the, if you do it to the power of a cubit, then it becomes just A. Okay, so what's going to happen now? You can notice that the a from the top and the a from the bottom will cancel out, giving us density equals 3u over 4 pi r naught cubed. Now, if I put that, if you, hopefully you notice that u is a constant, r naught is a constant. So I put these numbers in there, making sure to convert the femtometers into meters. I get a density of the nucleus is equal to 3.43 times 10 to the 17 kilograms per meters cubed, which is very dense, but of course that's where most of the mass of the atom is concentrated in the nucleus, so we expect it to be very dense. Comment on your result. So if you look at these, this equation, you can notice that it's just constants in there. U is a constant, R naught is a constant. So that means the density of the nucleus doesn't depend on the radius or the atomic mass unit. Okay, so the density of the nucleus is constant, it doesn't depend on the nuclear number or the uh, size of the nucleus doesn't depend on its radius.